Guys, not sure if you've ever seen our handy dandy engine lift plates, but we got one here mounted on a Gen 3 LS. We got a Gen 4 LS, Gen 5, which is an LT. Hellcat, look at the, it's for a boat. We got Hellcat engine lift plates, we got modular engine lift plates, and then we got Coyote engine lift plates. And today I'm gonna show you just how strong these lift plates are. Shyster, inbound. Them, yeah. Got right. a big heavy chain. This looks good. Hold on. Look at that, dude. Oh, Part wow. one success. You guys want to pull that engine stamp thing off? No, we'll leave it on there. Oh, oh, oh he's hitting the arm. Arm button's on. Arm button. Oh, here we go. Low enough to make out the door. Okay. Go. How did they pick that up? It's low enough. Am I high enough? Yep. Are you fine? Uh oh. They're picking that one in the door. A little more? I gotta get through the door, Sam. I got you. I got you. Easy enough. Easy. Good. Pick it up. Go. Oh. Pick it up. Go. Good. You're gonna ruin the box, right, man. You're gonna ruin the box. Sorry, Sam. Oh, look, here we go. Have mercy. They're going to ruin the floor. They're going to ruin the block. Oh, you're going to put it in the truck? I I'm see. Gonna, no, I'm going to lift the back of the truck. Lift plate is going to be strong enough to hold the engine and the back of Don's pickup truck. Yikes. All it's right. a big truck, bud. I know, all right? Oh, watch the tailgate. <laughs> Brother. <laughs> Jeez Louise. <laughs> there we go. We'll do the old classic. Ram it through the hole. Put it right up to Doug's pickup up truck. On down. <laughs> On. down. A little slower than last time. Okay. All right. On up a little bit. Up a little bit. Okay. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, prepare to see the strength of Motion Raceworks engine lift plate. Oh! Oh, it's a chain slipping because it's just That's looped. Chain slipping. I could probably hold it. Oh! You're picking the truck up. That's. Now that's a lift plate. Oh, <laughs> Hell yeah. Brother. Yeah. That's an engine lift plate right there, son. Nice to say, uh. Oh, yeah. 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 Yeah
safety first. Get a Motion Raceworks engine lift plate. Don't risk it with two 10 millimeter bolts. Get a lift plate. It can lift an entire truck. Hell yeah, brother. You're on the Please Me Fall on YouTube channel. Those for the FedEx truck? <laughs> for the Blazer, brother. <laughs> yes, Check that sir. out. That's the W. See Wide that? babies. Holy crap. These things are huge. That's how you do wheelie oh, right there. That's a, that's a street wheelie coming right up. Does that say on it? Godzilla. Fred, Texas what could speed. that be? Dude, what's in there? What in tarnation do we have going here, brother? This here's a wheelie popper dry hopper 1000. Golly, what do we got? About 100 pounds? Give or take. Give or take 100 pounds about plus the weight of the hitch, about eight. About 10 pounds of weld. All right, Ooh, a little loose. I like how you designed it so it can be a wheelie bar. Yeah, dual purpose. Will the wheels hit first? Yeah, it looks like they actually will hit first. Okay. You hit them wheels, you might end up with them exit in the vehicle. Yeah. Yeah, one might spin off one way or another. But yeah. Kind of oh, that's on. true. Yeah. But. Oh. Okay. Design there was not. They didn't have any left hand thread. <laughs> not ideal. <laughs> <laughs> Let's throw some safety wire on that zip tie, maybe, you know? Yeah. The, uh, We're not going to worry about that for now. Built it with the idea of being able to add more. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, so guys, we were thinking the other day, if we're going to be doing this no prep thing, one, we need wider tires. So you guys saw the Mickey Thompsons we got with the W on them. Two, we need more weight bias in the back so we can do a wheelie on the street. Because yep. if we're losing, we might as well be doing a wheelie. You know what I mean? You're either going fast or looking cool trying, so we're going for the looking cool technique. Yeah, so we got a lot of weight way back from the back tire so ideally this is really gonna lever the blazer into doing a street wheelie so i guess we're ready to rip yeah we can also put one of these up high too you know being that it's yeah high center of gravity on this thing i think this is <laughs> this should be plenty so what we'll do is we'll take the weights off and try it with just the tire i think to see what yeah, it does we'll take the weight off to see if we gain anything going to the w tire them being a fresh tire over the old ones we had are definitely yeah. going to be an advantage. So we'll see what we picked up with that. Maybe throw some more in it and then throw the weight on it and see All what right. it does. Let's go do it. We also have had several different prep style juices laying around, so we're switching. We're going to try them all. We're going to try them all. So I mean, far, I'm, I'm happy with all of them. Yeah. The other day worked good. This will probably work good, too. All right. Is there fuel in there? Yep. We're going to need that. How you feeling? She's topped off. I'm feeling like if I felt any better, I'd already be on two wheels. I think you're really psyched about this no prep stuff. Oh, I'm loving it. I'm loving <laughs> it. I mean, look at this. Just looking at this, the driveway. This fires you up. This fires me up. All right. We'll suit up, brother. Let's make a little rip. A little tire chip rip. So same tune up. Fresh tires. Yep. Oh, Is there right. actual glitter? Let me see. <laughs> There's actual the glitter. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. All right. So this is bigger tire. No weight at the moment on the wheelie popper dry hopper 1000. Here we go now. We'll burn out. Yeah, that's about So we just stick the weight on, see what it does? <laughs> oh. That gave, that gave me a little scared, not gonna lie. <laughs> All right, what's the plan now? Add that 100 pounds and see what it does. The tires aren't even broken in, so we want to throw the weight on it and just see the difference. And guys, you really can't see these tires are broken in yet, but we're just gonna say screw it and throw the weight on it. And just see the difference. Do you want James to drive so yeah, someone will stay in it? Boy, put the weight on. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'll lift after it gets second gear. It seemed like that. That I go any good. faster, I ain't gonna be able to stop, brother. No, I know I know, I know. Work in this thing. <laughs> <laughs> that didn't seem like too bad of a first hit. No, it was good. We need to get a G meter on this thing, maybe a draggy. Yeah. Okay, here we go. We are weighted up. What could go wrong? Are we just skipping doing 50 pounds, just going straight for 100? Straight to 100. Straight to 100. All right, another burnout.
barely turning the tire. <laughs> that is awesome. Come make a hit in the Raptor later. Blazer couldn't even spin them. Definitely is moving faster. Now this is where we play. Do we give it the more power to make it do the same thing as doing without the weight? Or I don't know. Or in the tire? Or do we just keep adding weight till it wheelies? What are your tire pressures? That was uh, 12 and a half pounds. In my professional opinion, you drop them a pound, I'll add some power. Ty, what do you think? Sounds good to me. All right, let's do it. Speed up there, right? Yeah, yeah, we'll speed it up. try that one felt good. we're gonna put some more power in it yeah. we're gonna drop tire pressure do another big burnout yeah put you right in it and we're hoping for that wheelie i know the ground is getting tight Dude, it is like the track it is getting sticking. tight all right we added a little bit of timing back in there so hold on <laughs> it's starting to hook up that's sweet doesn't even want to do a burnout now. I think he's still in second, so might need to do the burnout to first now. Oh, that's funny. That's funny. It's going to be good. I like this. I like this. Down there. Grab that fire extinguisher. It's it's good. It's not on fire. What happened? What's the deal? Huh? Engine locked up. It was spin, but there's a lot of stuff going on. In oh there. no! What's the deal? I just I couldn't hear, but I just felt. <laughs> What? Oh, I shoot. think it might have. It might have broke the crank, broke a rod. Hopefully, it's just. Oh wow, the loose. bell's loose. Oh, you snapped the crank. Look at the angle. Oh, the crank's broke. The crank finally broke. After all that, the crank breaks Dang. on such Dude, a low power setting. That front driver tire off the ground. The whole well, way down. it's a good thing we wow. got a short block sitting in the back room. It's a good thing because we don't have a lot of time. Hey, yeah, it made it a lot longer than we all thought it would. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, buddy. Don't be too bummed out. Felt like she was gonna do a wheelie the next time. The it next would've. time, dude. It would have. That was the first time it picked up the front left. Oh, it did? Yes. Yeah, it this engine, though, for real, made it a lot longer than we all thought. We all thought that crank was snapping off I mean, one weekend. Head gaskets were blown about three <laughs> times ago. <laughs> we might as well go straight to the shop, right? Yeah, let's just push it. Damn, RIP. Right. Turn it over real quick. Really? Yeah, just hit it one time. Let's see what it looks like. Okay, okay. Yep. Yeah, Whoa. Like that. Crank was definitely wobbling, brother. There's oil. <laughs> you got oil on our drag strip, George. Now we have to try and slap the blazer back together with all the spare time we have before TX2K. Crap. Well, that sucks. Yep. Oh, wow. Wow. She is definitely out of round, brother. Crazy oh, after we'll all see. this time and like we were running 25 pounds of boost to the track. Now we're on 18 and it just finally chose a, a point. Oh no. <laughs> the whole balancer might just pop right out if you do that a couple more times. Uh, it looks like it. Well, guys, we'll keep you updated on the blazer. We definitely have to get this back together really fast. So that sucks, but per usual, we'll figure it out. 
that's it for now. Thanks for watching. Do it for Dale. We'll freaking see you later. It's been an expensive month. Shoo-wee!